I am not a morning person. Left to my own devices, I'll happily sleep in. These days, I am most definitely not left to my own devices. This little rooster here crows well before dawn. I used to drag through the early morning hours, but I've recently used Link to get us all out to the dog beach for sunrise. We watch the first light of day reach across the water, and then we watch Zero and Penny show us how to make the most of this first waking moment. Under surreal skies, these two dancing shadows perform a wild choreography across the empty beach. And under gray skies, when the sun is hidden, the dogs continue to happily romp. The colors change, but their joy never does. A sunrise is a thing of beauty by itself. To witness one alone is a thing of wonder. But I've found sharing it together to be even more wonderful. The dogs play, Lincoln laughs, and the wind blows loose the cobwebs asleep. And for a few moments, it feels like the day was made just for us. In truth though, it is always we who make the day. We who decide where to meet the light and what to do with it for its brief trip across the sky. And sometimes that decision is outsourced to a small but incredibly loud human. And as much as I dislike waking up in darkness, I'm grateful to him for helping us find the light each morning. If you don't have a rooster of your own, one day this summer, I recommend rising early to take your dog somewhere for sunrise. I'm not sure what type of light you'll find, but I'm certain they'll run, you'll smile, and you'll share the best start to a day anybody could ask for.